All right, so I'm struggling through the content these days, uh, specifically around the Land Rover, and we're going to be on the road for a couple of weeks. And by the time you see this, we're probably already gone and on the way. So one of the things I'm doing at the moment is setting up a tent. We have a little electric shower somewhere, but it's a bit of a problem, and it's one of those cheap $20 ones that gets full of rust. And we changed the pump for a, uh, a bilge pump, which works a lot better, but out of a 10 litre bucket, you don't get a lot of time. Now, I found um, some recycled uh, aluminium chair that come off the beach. I recovered that during a rubbish expedition and a piece of aluminium pipe I had laying around and a spare hook and one of these uh, shower buckets from Aussie Disposals, very similar to what Les Hiddens uses in uh, the Bush Tucker Man. And uh, these are good little shower heads. You get a good bit of water in them. It's good to sort of wet down, soap up and rinse off and then a little bit of warm time. And uh, I've cut a slight slot in the top of our cheap pop ablution tent and so yeah we've got a good little uh, shower solution on the side of the ambo and uh if you're wondering how this goes in here it basically just wedges in under the roof box and so very simple to put in two sections and the sun's in my face here so i thought this was a fairly elegant and fairly simple solution um where that works you're going to ask how we heat the water well there's two different ways you could use a gas cooker you could use a pot on the fire um, but when we're driving, we fill this little guy up full and we leave it boil on the way. This is a boiling vessel from an AFE. Um, I also have one out of a um, Centurion tank. Pulls 55 amps, but it boils it really quickly, um, which also works. And we have the secondary alternator plus a crap ton of solar panel on the roof of this thing as well. So multiple ways we can heat water, but this makes for a hot shower with a bit of privacy at a free camp, which is the main reason that I uh, like a, a normal campsite is for the showers and also the power. And uh, it's good days at the moment, so solar power might not be so much of a problem, and uh, the shower should work out pretty well. So hopefully that uh, satiates you for a bit of content in the meantime, and uh, we'll see you on our return for some longer, more interesting videos.